yep, there's an Alta here. Let's take a look at this thing. This is a super short video uh, featuring a bike that no longer is a manufacturer anymore, but it's pretty crazy and kind of cool. So let's look at the starting procedure. Uh, turn this little key. Things flash. And then you still have to hit this button, which cracks me up. So now it's on. We're gonna twist the throttle and away we go. So weird. I know I really should have a helmet on, so I'm sorry about that. But this is just crazy. <laughs> this thing is nuts. I'm gonna turn around. It's just weird. It makes no sound other than the chain and the woo. Here we go. That's 20, 30, 40, 50. This thing is crazy. bikes but I have to say this thing is pretty awesome it's kind of too bad they went out of business because I think there's a lot of future in this uh, technology for sure um, let's walk around this thing so you guys can kind of check it out hang on go ahead and put it up here turn it off so something weird doesn't happen but yeah Oh, there we go. Oh, back in focus. So, yeah, there it is. The Alta Redshift. This is the MX version. That's why it doesn't have a kickstand on it. Let's see. Uh, there's the battery right there. Big old thing. And there's the tiny little motor down in there. Um, it uses all, like, KTM chassis parts. So, like, at least the same shape and size. Wheels, uh, spacers, bearings, WP shock, WP... Uh, four CS forks. Um, yeah, it's a crazy thing. It's uh, it's nuts. <laughs> it's uh, it's really cool, honestly. Like, I don't necessarily want one, but man, the torque is crazy, and you can change obviously the character of the power with just some buttons and a computer and stuff. Anyway, there you go. Thought you guys might like to see that. There are not that many of them around. Um, they're a lot of fun. You guys have a great day. Find some time to ride. You dirt bikes!